play for Hollywood That phony super coney Hollywood They come from Chillicothe and Paducah's With their bazookas to get their names up in lights But if you think that you can be an actor See Mr. Factor, he'd make a monkey look good Hooray for Hollywood Hello, all. I've been asked to guest host this special Oscar food cook-off edition of Cinema Monkeys. <laughs> Rocket and Zoom, we're happy to have you here today as our contestants. <laughs> Thank you, Anthony. It's a thrill to be here and to be working with you. I, I hope this is all right to say, but you are a legend in this town that shines like gold. I feel unabashedly giddy just being in your presence. You've embarrassed me. And you've embarrassed yourself. You've made this entire thing feel awkward. So no, it is not all right. Thanks a lot to Zoom. If it helps, I'd never even heard of you before today. Your honesty is refreshing. Thank you, Sprocket. So, this is a competition, and I have a surprise for you. The winner is going to be invited to my exclusive Oscar after party, hobnobbing with the stars. <laughs> and the loser is going to be euthanized. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. We would never invite either one of you to the Oscar party. The rules are quite simple. We're going to go through each of the nominees for Best Picture. And each of you will make a dish to go with that film. We're going to start with The Shape of Water. <laughs> you have 40 minutes. Let's get cooking! <laughs> fresh grilled rainbow trout with a side of baby carrots to symbolize the carrots in the gold statuette which I predict Senor del Toro will walk away with on Sunday. And the piece de resistance is a trendy blue wine symbolizing the ocean with a single ice cube inside in the shape of a fish. And in creating the ice cube I have in fact, manipulated the shape of water. Hmm. Ice in wine is a major faux pas. You should know that. It waters it down. Sprocket. Well, I've got a meatloaf in the shape of a cat, smothered in ketchup to simulate the cat's blood. This round goes to Sprocket. <laughs> yes. Your next film is Get Out. Now, get cooking. <laughs> I call this my Get Out Cookie. Well, isn't that clever? Zoom. I've made a banana boat because it's chocolate. It has a peel. Which, of course, is a bit of a, a play on words because, you see, the film has appeal and it's directed by appeal, Jordan Peele. And the Banana Boat song, made popular by Harry Belafonte, like Get Out itself, is actually about slavery. So you like songs about slavery, do you? <laughs> well, uh, no, 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 not... Round to Sprocket. Let's keep going. The next film is The Post. I made an alphabet soup to symbolize a printing press. I made some freshly squeezed lemonade with vodka and I'm charging a dollar a glass. Drink it while you watch the Oscars. Take a shot every time somebody mentions Trump. Ladybird. Well, since it is a coming of age film, I have a nice aged I've gone with a pair of young chicken breasts, but out of respect for Sir Ronan, I haven't touched them. Three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri. Missouri barbecue. A southern omelette. I've beaten the eggs vigorously, but it's okay because I'm funny. Phantom thread. 
I made these nice sausage bites threaded with spaghetti. Mr. Colin, this is the Gungan Burger. It's a mooey, mooey, tasty ground salmon burger with a strip of bacon on each side. They're supposed to be as ears. Big fish burger, huge, old day. Whose ears? This was supposed to be Paul Thomas Anderson's. Oh, Phantom Thread! I, I, I was thinking Phantom Madison. <laughs> Makes a lot more sense. <laughs> Charge her. Darkest hour. I have lovingly crafted a dark chocolate lava cake equipped with a timer so that it will erupt exactly on. The hour. I just uh, put some Winston cigarettes on uh, an English muffin. Call me by your name. I played off of the Italian theme and I made what I call rigatoni effete. You see, it's a it's a fresh rigatoni with a white bologna sauce, and I called it by your name. My name is Antony. Not Tony. Nobody calls me Tony, save my closest friends. Are you one of my closest friends, Zoom? Peaches and cream. That is disgusting! You are disgusting! If you don't know why that's disgusting, please don't Google it! I can't believe you that it's just... Round to Sprocket. That's it. I'm leaving. What? Hey, wh 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 where are you going? We're not done yet. Oh, big deal. So I won't get to see you serve Dunkirk Donuts out of a box. <gasps> oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Tonight's contestants will receive a year's supply of post-brand cereal, the Roman J. Israel Chia Pet, and the home edition of Molly's Game. <laughs>